The vassal is with the Templar Admiral on the lead ship, Captain. Once he gives the orders, it will be lost. The parcel itself is less interesting than its intended recipient. Let's eliminate this errand boy, Admiral, and unmask the true Templar threat. Fire! When I became an assassin, I swore to be piracy. But the old methods have served the creed more than once. Ready to fire! Ready, Captain! Aye, and often it's necessary. Bastien Joseph, Port-au-Prince. What business do Templars have there? Captain! More French vessels at our tail! Too many! We'll retreat through the storm! We will be smashed ashore! A worse fate awaits if we let this land in Templar hands! Aye, Captain! Here we go! 
A Lord pirate knows when to run. Rescue yourselves! I must stay with the ship! No, I will stay with you! Saltrui Non Ça te coûtera une oreille Bah, John. The Templar can wait. This woman must not suffer. Arrête de courir, salope Ou je te tronche les deux oreilles Non Oh Est-ce bon Dieu Désolé. I have nothing to offer but thanks. Nothing else is needed. As a boy, I fled the same fate. Why would you risk recapture? Men of principle know the bigger risk is to turn away. I'm looking for Bastien Joseph. Do you know her? Moi même. Pas qu'on elle. But any fine gentleman may lead you to her. Too late for this one. Find another in town. The thanks is now mine. Do you have a place of refuge? My family waits in the mountains. Demon, gemon. Que Dieu soit avec vous. For it. Monsieur Gouverneur, they felt safe at the plantation. Do you think they would rebel? <laughs> of course. It's their animal nature. 
violence is the only currency that motivates them. Like coin. If you, if you really want to protect your African friends, spread the word. Quiet them down. Otherwise, you need not describe. I know that. Could not lose a hand or hurt a fly. But the overseers have every right to plead as they so fate. It would not be necessary. I will deliver your message. The cost will be high. We will both profit by it. Is there any other service you require? Gouverneur? Oh, an old man like me. I dare say Grisan has exhausted me already. Then show yourself out. Madame Joseph, expecting a package. It, but not you. Where's l'admiral? I see. And do you mean for me to meet the same fate? Look around. One threat, and these men will end you. I bring no threat. Tell me, how do the Templars allow you to carry on like this? <laughs> I am only the messenger. But before you judge, remember, the Templar's coin, like any, will buy the freedom of men like you. I know this, Mark. You know nothing. You have the brand of a slave. The eloquence of a scholar. Hands of a sailor and an assassin's hood. Few weapons. I think the storm stranded you. What do you need? A ship? Shelter? These things can be had for the price of this parcel. I need nothing I can't win for myself. But prove that what you promise is true. And perhaps something can be arranged. Is this your game? Very well. And you will do me a favor. Augustin Dufort is a very secretive man. First find his plantation contact and give him this message from the Gouverneur. Augustin will give you all the proof you need. Repeat this password. Silly patoto crabla va manje. Silly patoto crabla va manje. Pas mal. A convincing baraton. Now I suggest you leave before my admirers get suspicious. Wise man is down that path. Thank you, sister.
Let them escape. The river. Hurry before they bring more enemies. What's that? Don't know. Did you miss one? Grow faster. Faster, idiot. This is as fast as I can go. Don't just sit there. Shoot him. Shoot him. Augustine, dear fall. <laughs> Blandi sans fait. Bon Dieu fait sans dit. The French governor is two-faced. Bastien helps as she can. But Marron independence is long to build. <sighs> Longer now. A warrior like you would be a great asset to our cause. With due respect, I serve a different brotherhood and I'm honor bound to return as soon as I find the means. But only the Iwa know when that will be. Meantime, I have sanctuary and weapons to share. Perhaps our needs may align for a time. What do you need? Recruits, liberated slaves. The warriors among them join me. The others. Grow the community for which we fight. Titapti, Moazo Fesoni. I suppose I might lend a hand for a time. Bipti Pashi. I will see that you are rewarded for whatever you can give. Best begin soon. There's much to do. Fortune favor you. Every day, more slaves arrive. Human cargo makes for lucrative trade. I once hoped men of education could be made to see the cost. The profit makes them ignorant. With the right vessel, you could intercept the slave ships before they arrive. Or you would be free to leave. 
You have already paid more than your share to the Mao of Sinomang, and I am no master. I cannot choose for you. This brigantine could meet your needs if you could relieve it of its crew. Bastien has volunteered her woman to draw the men away. Or you could set this tower light to distract them. Excellent options, all of them. What's this? Firecrackers. Some of your recruits salvaged them. It's only right that you should use them. Excellent. Once you send me a signal, I will send our men to join you. Monsieur Adwele, the Mayon cause has made an ally of you. Augustin speaks highly of your help. I do not know how much longer I'll be able to continue, but the Maroons are outstanding warriors. Augustine has provided me with everything I might need to get by until I return to my brothers. I believe you owe me a parcel then. Let me hold it a while longer, for safekeeping. You are not a man of your word. My word was perhaps. It stands. How little you must think of me. On the contrary, you have maintained your freedom among the French by the deft handling of your indispensable business. I respect you highly. What would be a fool to trust anyone so clever so soon? What a keen eye and sweet tongue you have. Since you cannot provide me with the one thing I truly desire, I hope to compel you to demonstrate some respect by some other means. I would consider it. I need a careful and observant man to investigate the Gouverneur. I must know what distracts him. 
and why he enforces the Code Noir ever more strictly. The lives of the slaves depend on it. I share your curiosity. I'll pay you this favor for the slaves. Perhaps there is some honor in you yet. You will need a disguise. Please, change into these. A slave's rags. What do you mean by this indignity? Do you mean to see me recapture? Indignity? Do you hold your enslaved brothers in such low esteem? Do you hold any man in high esteem? Or are we all pawns to you? <laughs> you should be so lucky. There is no trick. It is only that... Well... The Gouverneur de Fayette will host a soirée soon. And imagine... I am not invited. <laughs> the excess of the occasion calls for an abundance of supplies to be delivered to his mansion. That's where you come in. With your crate, you will blend in with the men delivering the goods. Once on the grounds, you can spy on the good gouverneur. Will the overseers not notice one man extra? Or are you simply unconcerned for my well-being? <laughs> I've never met an overseer who could tell two slaves apart. Nevertheless, be careful. I sense you are as bright as you are strong. You will figure it out. Yes, ma'am. Here they come. Join the line. Be careful. What's going on back there? Fall in line! Who are you? A friend. This is a joke to you. No. You will get us all killed. down there, cher monsieur. <laughs> All right, enough uh, socializing. Back to work. Grounds must be fit for a king when my guests arrive. Visit bastards. Both of them should be whipped. I'm a prince, you realize? I'm a prince for putting up with them. What good is complaining? I will remember you said that. Quiet now. Friend, does the guard change often? As often as night moves today. Thank you. If you are a friend, who will be blocked? I heard you gave Bacton's girl a jewel worth more than half the fleet. Does this account for the missing craft?
Lust. But the science of navigation is expensive. I dare say it is. If you measure every fathom in perfume and silk. Spanish vessel is available. Could we not use a French ship? Are you trying to start a war? A treaty between our nations is fragile. We cannot afford any suspicion of smuggling. Your name will go down in history with mine if you supply the funds and the ship. Thank you for the offer, but I have an expensive colony to govern. With the volume of slaves you import, I'd have thought you'd have gold to spare. Even free labor is not free, my friend. Slaves are expensive to replace. The poor beasts expire before they can reproduce. Even your slave ships would benefit from improved navigation. Fewer accidents. Now that is interesting. <laughs> What have you learned? The governor is overconfident. Despite his guard, I could have ended him with my bare hands. He would have deserved it. What makes you believe you need him? I keep my friends close, and my enemies closer. Which camp are you in? Will you tell me what you have learned? Who distracts him? A bold-faced scientist, Godin, hounds the governor for funds. Something about an expedition, navigational secrets. Why is this the first time I hear of him? Is my whole network turned against me? Does the harbor master think I give him my best girls out of kindness? Do you wish me to investigate further? I admit, as a man of the sea, the science of navigation intrigues me. No. Yes. I don't know. As you wish, but leave me, I must think. Bastien, I feel we lost you to the bitterness of depression. Never. Those arrogant men cannot cut me out of my own network. The cost is too great for the slaves. And for your pride. What does it matter, so long as I work for their freedom? Whatever has inspired it, I'm glad to hear the fight back in your voice. How can I help? The scientist, Gouda. What is his full purpose here? Can you find that out? Whatever secrets he carries, I will uncover. Start with the harbor master. He sees everyone who comes and goes. He should have kept me informed. Geodesic expedition. The governor of the fire requests that 
Monsieur Gaudin's geodesic expedition be equipped with every resource it demands. The first need is rather unusual. Monsieur Gaudin requires, for reasons of scientific record keeping, three uh, literate slaves. Uh, who would have taught them? The Côte Noire Prohibits. Perhaps among your house slaves, uh, such a worker exists? You may communicate it privately. There is a reward. But what will they do? Take notes, I suppose? Can none of the French scientists take notes? Not if they are to carry equipment at the same time. That pouch must be important. Spain continues to insist the expedition wait for a Spanish ship. But we are allies now. Can they not be persuaded to allow a single French vessel passage in the name of science? We are, after all, allowing Spanish chaperones on board. Signed, Louis Godet. He does not realize the risks of this voyage. Alors, what did you find? An opportunity beyond imagination. These scientists aim to record navigational secrets for our beloved kings to use at war. But we can seize them to extraordinary advantage for my brotherhood and the Maroon. We need only supply literate recruits, and the rest will take care of itself. That is all. Nothing more on the governor. That is all? <laughs> that is everything! How many more could be freed with this knowledge in our hands? All things require balance, Adewale. To achieve independence, the Mayon require stability, animinity, and information. That has always been my role. What now? That is what I thought. The storm brought you in, and you will leave on the tempest of opportunity and imagination. And I will be left here. To do what I can. Powerless. No, any day now the Maroons will rise up. Then I will leave, not before I've decided. You are as arrogant as the French. Bria. All of you. That is all you are. Bastien? No. Go now. Adewale, your ambition still gives me pause, but I promised Auguste my help. What's this? The Forge Manifest, or so I am told. One of your famous recruits wrote it. Joachim Francois, Henri Marchand, Fortuné Jean. Good. 
I'm sure you will serve the expedition well. Louis Godin will meet with the harbor master to arrange the remaining affairs of your expeditionary voyage. You may take the opportunity to switch the manifest. At your signal, we will be ready to board. Thank you. And thank you, Bastien. Anything for the Mahon of Saint Domingue. Thanks is all mine. And now I must away for a meeting with the harbor master. All in the name of science, of course. Of course. Feel <laughs> <laughs> that? Perfect physical condition. Good day, monsieur. And to you as well. I trust the preparations are coming along well. Things certainly do seem to be busy. Indeed, sir. As you can see, my men are working around the clock to prepare everything. You may expect a fine vessel fitted to precisely the demands of science and your other activities. What other activities? Do not worry about the things. I will be attending. There is only an outstanding matter of your place. Do you have the name for the manifest? Yes, right here. Good news! Come then. We must be itching to inspect everything. Indeed, I am. Keep up the good work and keep the rats out of Black flag. They'll be picked to the bone. Give me some speed! We must defend that ship. French or not, these scientists must reach their destination. Our people must capture their secrets. The knowledge is more important than any cargo. Aye, Captain. It is worth the fight. With a little skill in the right wind, it won't last long. Picture it, Augustine. Once you are trained and our recruits return with these navigational secrets, you will be able to go explore and recruit from any land. It will be a great temptation. My fight is in poor affairs, and you are. I must be focused. Build a maroon navy then. Do not mistake my gratitude, Adewale. This ship is a grand blessing, an advanced knowledge of the sea. Boon to our cause. But the Maron do not crave an empire. Only in the of our own territory. Very well, Augustine. But mark my words. You will be fit to command a navy. Of one ship or many. When our work here is done.
Ade, Augustin has learned of another slave ship to intercept. I beg you to reconsider. Special orders from the sometimes confidant the governor. No, it is as I feared. With all the slaves you have freed, the French are in panic. Let the French live in the fear they earned. It is not so simple. Curfews are strict. Punishments are harsher and more frequent. You help the ones you freed, but at what cost to the ones you can't? A small price for independence. The sooner Augustine's revolution comes, the sooner all slaves will live in peace as free people. Gouverneur de Fayette threatens retaliation. And he is behind this. No. Adwali. Not another word. I don't want to hear it. Your pirate days. Did you cross many slave ships? More than a few. But when I sailed with Kenway, plunder was the only prize. Plunder or information leading to more plunder. Did you never wish to intervene? It is wise for a quartermaster to keep his wishes to himself, if he also wishes to remain as quartermaster. But yes, the thought did cross my mind. When the assassins offered me the opportunity to pursue more serious aims, I left the plundering behind. But the slave ships also? No, for I am still an assassin, and I have found them again. I would not trade my years as a pirate for anything. You enjoyed your freedom. They hardened me for the work we do today. And when I am done, you will also have pirates to thank for your training. Yes, Captain. No! They'll sink the ship! I think we must act fast! Captain's head! Ready to bark, Captain! I'll go below. Control these fires, then prepare the expert to...
gouverneur de Fayette. I thought I understood his indifference. I did not anticipate the extent of his heartlessness. You tried to warn me. We are all guilty. A governor will pay with his own life. My creed demands that I see to it. Je lève ma cigarette. Revenge is called comfort. Once the fire is gone, another tyrant will take his place. His death must give this generation of warriors hope. They must not abandon the goal of independence. And the death of these souls? Some barely new life. We will always mourn them. I believe it is time. The governor grows complacent. His guards lazy. They have already forgotten the terror they wrought. I will remind them. Once you have removed the fire, you will no longer be safe here. Nor will the Maroons be if I stay. It will bring me sadness to see you go. We will meet again to celebrate Maroon independence. You know well the grounds of the governor's residence. Choose your moment. Do not get caught. the ghost ship. Brothers, they did not survive the journey here. I will personally find and kill every last one of you until I find my answer. Where is the hideout of the Maroons? Come to your rescue. Your slaves? The overseers who follow your orders? Pathetic. What kind of man does not fight for himself? Why? I have killed many men on principle, but never have I wanted one to suffer 
as much as you to understand what it is to gasp and beg for your life like the innocents you drowned. You mean those slaves? That ship? But they are not even human. Without the discipline and guidance of their masters, they turn to rebellion. Murder. <laughs> like you. I only wish that were true. It is done. He suffered badly. I made sure of it. Have you come to say goodbye? For now. But not without giving you this. Oh. After all this time, you lost interest. You're not worried it will fall into Templar's hands? I fear worse things now. No Templar plot can equal your wrath. <laughs> you tried to make light at a time like this? Only to lighten my sorrow at leaving. You will return to your brotherhood of assassins and whatever duty they assign you. I will return, yes. But I feel a tide changing within me. I'm no longer young. I must devote my energy to those who struggle for freedom. I will use my conviction in my creed to defend them alongside anyone who will help me. I have no one left to serve this to. I will keep it for memory. <laughs> 